Okay. <laughs> you wanted to leave and go on to the next world. Your path was blocked by some unknown god? What kind of intro is this? Your journey ends here. Who are you? The sustainer of heavenly principles. The irrigation of mankind ends now. I mean, it looks cool. I guess. <laughs> okay. Top tier voice acting. And just like that, a god took away my sister. Some kind of seal was cast upon me, and I lost my power. So while we used to travel from world to world, we are now trapped here. Makes sense, I guess. Do 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 do. Load screen. How many Great. years ago was it? Uh, oh, I don't wait, know. I'm still in cutscenes. But I intend to find out. When I woke, I was all alone until I met you two months ago. Yeah, okay. Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. Uh, can Paimon shut up? <laughs> we should head off. Let's get going. <laughs> Ah, a tutorial level. Okay. Depletes stamina and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Does okay, it? Let's take the wrong way. I don't want any music. Okay. There we go. Not exactly sure what that does. Oh, wow. Oh, this is just 
weird tutorial stuff. <laughs> Uh, I mean the game looks. That's a statue of the sun. Cool, or I guess somewhat beautiful and appealing. There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show the seven's protection over the world. Among the seven gods, this god controls the wind. Paimon's not sure whether the god you're looking for is the animal god, but. Paimon will take you to the animal god's place first, and there's a reason why. The outlander who caught the wind. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. Okay. I want to hop to it, but you move so slow. You can swim right over. Shark out of nowhere. Okay. Man, so far this is all just cutscenes. They aren't nicely done, but... <laughs> oh. Okay, what was the point in that? Ooh, did just you just to get a layout on the map? World? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of animal. As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh-huh. It's because you're not from this world to begin with. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the city of freedom. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of animal. So perhaps, because you got power from the god of Animo, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then! The elements in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Ah! Yay! Disappear! These are the animal powers you got from the Statue of the Seven! That was cool. Oh, Paimon's so jealous! Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting power? Cause you don't need them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why you don't get them. There's achievements. There's a lot of achievements.
the heart of the forest. We must proceed with caution. What? Okay, that's just unfair. <laughs> we go beat up these things to make me feel better. I do feel slightly better. I'll keep this close. What did I get? Adventures Golden Gum. Okay. A lot of fruits and stuff here. Do I purpose to them? Do, do, do. Oh, catch the lizard! Catch the lizard! Ah. Gotcha! Oh, did I just... I just murdered the lizard. Wow. Um. Oops. Okay, now what? Another cutscene. Apparently. Huh? Look at that. <laughs> uh... Don't be afraid. It's all right now. I'm back. Is he talking to a dragon? <gasps> I guess that's normal, talking to a dragon. <laughs> or not normal. That was close. Paimon almost got blown away. Luckily, Paimon managed to grab hold of your hair. Thanks. Just what was that? Paimon thought we were gonna get eaten. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Of course not. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. Let's go take a closer look. Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. Never seen it before? What use are you? All Paimon <laughs> knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. If you never have seen it before, then how do you know it's dangerous? Oh my god. Dramatic, the animal god protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? Uh. Hey, that's even worse than being a mascot. <laughs> so 
want yes, to sum it, it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. Yeah, then you're not a very good knight, I are you? <laughs> my apologies. Uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake. <sighs> I'm with the emergency food. <laughs> Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? There's a handbook? Then why aren't you following it? <laughs> you started off... You started off not following it. Suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? He got separated from his sister during a really, really long journey. Paimon is his travel buddy, helping him to find his sister. Oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... Okay, let me finish my other stuff first. Okay. She has an artifact. Or something? What? Oh. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. Will I? I don't think I will. Ugh. Catch the squirrel! Catch the squirrel! Why won't you let me catch the squirrel? Dang it. Uh, a hilly turtle! Quick, get it! have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. Okay. But what, what this place? with your moves there. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Now that you mention it, how is it the hilly trails ended up here? Uh, we, uh, we didn't mention it, did we? These creatures Them being don't here? seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries, so the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer? Exactly. That okay. said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Are you responsible? I didn't realize that. I'll keep this close.
Okay. Oh wow, that's gonna be a bit of a walk. What's that? It smells good. What? What should I cook next? Oh, are you travelers from around here as well? No, we just happen to be passing by. What are you cooking? Smells good! Doesn't I see. Smell good. Welcome, travelers. I'm Lynn, the survival expert of the Adventurer's Guild. As you can see, I'm experimenting with some new recipes. Eat before you go. The first rule in the Wilderness Survival Guide. Is it the first rule in the wilderness of Robert Guide? I wouldn't oh, know. Oh, Paimon just loves picnics! My travel partner here is good at cooking as well. Oh, there's a cooking pot right there. Show me what you got. It's good to have someone to practice with. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Try making a chicken mushroom skewer for me. Okay. Is it done? Smells good. Let okay. me try. Let's go. Mm. Uh, mm. Cooking. Uh, Just I. Uh oh. Now that's really tasty. You are indeed gifted. Hyman told you so. With your culinary skills, you should try more difficult dishes. Oh, I've got some raw ingredients in my bag. Have them in return for this meal. Can we really have them? Won't you run out of ingredients? That's okay. You should be able to find lots of ingredients when exploring the wilderness. Don't forget to look carefully. There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good Hunter that sells food and ingredients. Go have a look when you've got the time. Okay, thank you for the info. <gasps> hey, leave some chicken mushroom skewers for Paimon! Whatever you want to be, Digimon. All right, well, I'm going to end this video here, and uh, I'm, I'm kind of interested to see, you know, where this goes from here. Thanks for watching this when you do. Subscribe if you want, and don't forget to give yourselves a big thumbs up. Goodbye.